This is the results of my wash day with no product in yet. I just wanted to show you guys how it looks. So first, you want to take down that pineapple. Yes, 3C hair does get stiff. If you wear, <laughs> wear that pineapple for a couple days, a mess, girl. Yes, I know. <laughs> we gonna wash it though. So this is freshly rinsed hair. Now I'm gonna shampoo with sulfate free. Okay, you see? And only on my scalp. I talk about this in my tips to transition to healthy hair about only using shampoo on your scalp. Shampoo is very drying and it's a cleaner. So the ends of your hair don't get that dirty like your scalp where all the buildup and the dandruff will be. I know when you go to the hair salon, they sometimes shampoo your hair two or three times. No. I only do it once, so I make sure I do it really well. Shampoo naturally strips your hair of the natural oils that you have. And while it does clean your scalp, you don't really need to use it as much as we are like taught to use it. Only scrubbing with the paddles of my finger, never my nails. Stimulating your scalp, you're promoting blood flow to it, which will promote hair growth. Then this is rinsed out. Now I'm gonna add some conditioner. I split my hair in half and then I add it to one side. Concentrating on my ends first. And then working my way up. And then I add it to the other side, concentrating on my ends. And then I work my way up. So what I do is called the campfire method, where I'm rubbing my hands together, starting from my root and going down to my ends. It helps to detangle your hair at the same time as hydrating each individual strand. As you see, I only used a little bit of conditioner. And using this method, it allows me to use less product. It hydrates my hair more and it detangles my hair at the same time without so much hair breaking off. Then I just repeat on the other side. And you see, not so much breakage. I start to detangle with a wide tooth comb, starting from my ends first, always. So after you detangle, you just want to twist it up so it stays detangled while you shower. Because typically you would, you know, wash your hair while you're in the shower. So when you have the conditioner in, this is the time where you can shower. You know, get a little clean, clean a little booty. Now, this is typically when you would shower, and you know, that's about how much dead end should come off, so that's about right. And this is the result after rinsing out, after rinsing your body and your hair. Please like, subscribe, let me know what else you guys want to see. You can follow me on Instagram at Dr. Burley. Thanks, Burley gang.